Not only are you incompetent, but shameless to boot. Don't attack. Well, Don't attack. No Don't out. attack him. Now's as good a time as any. I uh, ah! There's a glintstone sorcerer by the name of Selen in Limgrave. I know Selen! She owes me for the help I gave her when she was expelled from the academy. I know her! I asked her to look into the matter some time ago. I'll write you a letter of introduction. Go ask her. Okay. She was the one way in the beginning. I think it was my during my first or second stream of this. We had a pumpkin head fight, boss fight, in like one of the tombs in the ruins. And then after that fight, I opened the door and there was a witch that does sorceries. She had a weird mask on and she was talking to us. That's her. That's her. Yeah, maybe, Crown, maybe. I have no time for that. The only thing I will hear for are we under I have enough. God, you suck. Alright. So he's proven to be useful after all. Good. Shall we go see how tough this Dargan is? Perchance? God damn it, boss lady. That's funny. Uh... How do I up? These are ruins. Maybe there's like a dungeon here or something. I don't see any of the statues though. That is a long way down. Please be careful. Watch your step. You will certainly f die if you jump that distance. What, boss lady? Let's do something wrong? What? What? Hi. Hi. Uh, every day when you're walking down the street. Alright. Hi! Glintstone Dragon Adula! Ooh, ice? Okay. Arcane. Farts! Okay, okay, okay. Regroup. Regroup. I was staggered. I couldn't move. Okay, he's going to be a tricky one. He's got crystals all over him. He's going to be a tricky one because of the space we're in. There's a lot of hills, a lot of ruins, and rubble to jump up and down. Hmm. Interesting. Hmm. Yeah, wow. Yes, yeah, this this one's a tough boy. Adula. Makes me think of Azula. Now I want to watch Avatar. Okay, if anything, let's go retrieve the runes. I don't even know if I got a hit on this dragon. <laughs> I can do good damage. Okay, this is gonna come back. How do I dodge that? Wow. I do not know how I would even dodge that. Maybe strafing to the side.
you stay on the dang ground? Yeah, do your stompies. Oh shit! I'm dead. I'm not dead. Come on, get up, get up, get up. Go, 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 go. Go, 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 go. Heal the horse. Ow! I gotta heal the horse. Just keep running for now. Keep healing the horse. Avatar is the best show you've rewatched those. Yeah. I've rewatched it quite a few times as well. That's okay. If we dis disengage. He doesn't lose uh he doesn't lose the health. You know, he doesn't go back to full health is my point. Okay. Literally working on the whole jump button thing. Did you see the dragon use a sword magic? Because I did. That was amazing. Ah! Okay, dodged it somehow. Cool. Oh, he's breathing fire. Take cover. Cover's broken! Cover's broken! Ah! I'm stuck. Okay. Cover may not work. Good gravy. You're gonna jump. What was that? doing good though okay where could he have gone he like went that way so maybe to this side I'm not gonna warp there because that'll probably just reset everything Dude, that was so wicked when he pulled out the sword, though. There's this huge great sword, just whack. That was awesome. Just noped out of the fight. Is that not supposed to happen? I think I hear him. Or am I hearing stuff behind me? Nope, I appear to be hearing stuff behind me. Where did the dragon go? He noped out for you as well. Have you found him? No, you know what? Don't answer. We just remember the dragon, Adula. And maybe we'll find him again. That was so cool, though. Hey, he's not over here. Maybe down there? I think inside the manor would be too small.
Well, now I have questions like... Do I need to find the dragon before I warp? Is that going to reset it if I warp before finding him? Like a... Um... Uh... I don't know. It's raining. It's pouring. I'm tired. <laughs> I think he could be down there. I actually see, like, civilization down there. I have no idea where that dragon went. Huh. Also kind of shitty ups and leaves. I mean, it could just be I beat the first phase. And Riblin said he did it to him too, so... I think it's just a matter of finding him. Maybe another area that's like crystal ridden. Kind of like this one. But I can't think of any off the top of my head because I'm a dingus. That's kind of cool. Maybe he went to the dragon hospital. It's possible. To tend to his wounds. Maybe he got scared of me. Ah, it's a dragon. I highly doubt that. I, I'd be flattered. But I doubt it. Oh, right, those enemies that are invisible. That was something else. Maybe he's all the way up there. Because he flew high, right? Maybe he's just up on top of that mountain. Wherever up there is. Because, like, yeah, he flew high. Huh. That's really interesting. Fun though while it lasted. That's for sure. I feel like it'd be safe to sit at a grace site then. I mean, with the dragon gone, I can kind of look around a little bit more thoroughly. I could be missing loot. Can you not? Oh, you little shit. That's very rude. I don't appreciate that. Uh. Got ya. Nah, 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 nah. Stinky poop face. That's what he gets. These just seem like just a bunch of ruins, not like the other ones. I don't think. like pretty regular just ruins resignation ahead okay probably referring to the dragon maybe what if the dragon could be a portion of the 
What if the dragon is the key to get to no Nocron? And he's just here? And, like, him flying away, like, creates a path or something. That'd be kind of sweet. But I think maybe a little too predictable. I'm sorry, is there a crab? There's just a giant crab hanging out in that manor. Glad I avoided that part, didn't... Uh, uh, crab. Crab. Uh, crab in the manor. Ridicule. The crab. Get the butt. Yeah, get the butter. They don't get the butter. I'm going to warp back really quickly. And then it'll reset everything and I'll see if the dragon respawns there or not. If it doesn't, then I guess that confirms the phase two somewhere else. <sighs> there is no dragon. Huh. Methinks there is a phase two on the way. Help is on the way, dear! Help is on the way! I wonder if that door is still closed. Hello! Hmm. Yeah, it seems the ruins are just ruins. Unless there's like an illusionary wall, there doesn't seem to be anything special about them. Yeah, butter. Perfect, Dino. You're gonna need a bigger butter boat. Like a butter dish. No, it appears this is still blocked off. Herm. Let me in! Poopy face. Fine! Alright, um... I guess the next step to all of this then is to... Go find What's-Her-Face in the caverns area where we found her in Limgrave. Now the question is... <laughs> which cave... Was it? Not Murkwater. I think Murkwater is where we found patches? Or Murkwater catacombs, one or the other. No, it wasn't catacombs, it was the cave. She wasn't- she was in the ruins. There was like a little, like, cellar area in the ruins. So, not Gatefront ruins, so maybe... Not Dragonburnt. Dragonburnt, uh, was where that teleporty chest was, that trap. So maybe Waypoint Ruins? Because I found her very early on. Or she could be Mistwood Ruins? No, Mistwood Ruins? Wait, was it Mistwood Ruins? No. Waypoint, Artist Shack. Let's try Waypoint. We'll start there. I think that said Waypoint Ruin Cellar, so I think this is actually the one. My memory... rewards me! But I want to read the item first. Scroll bearing a royal coat of arms, a letter of introduction written by Perceptor Soap. Addressed to a glintstone sorceress by the name of Selen. The contents of the scroll cannot be discerned. 
All right, sell us. You wanna sell us some sorceries? No, <laughs> no. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry. There you are, my apprentice. Yeah, it's been a while. Shall we commence the lesson? Yeah, absolutely. What do you have? Okay. Uh, show the letter. Celibus is not a name I ever wanted to hear again. It's same. We call him Soap. If it will help you, my apprentice, I offer my knowledge. The stars alter the fate of the Carian royal family <laughs> and the fate of your mistress, Rani. But long ago, General Radan challenged the swirling constellations and in a crushing victory arrested their cycles. Now he is the force that repulses the stars. If General Radan were to die, the stars would resume their movement. Uh oh. And so too would Rani's destiny. So you're telling me, you're telling me, I gotta go kill this dude. I think he was the one that was off in the east in Sadnessville. Uh oh. Oh boy. I think he's another one of the shard. Yeah, he's a shard bearer for sure. You wish to continue very well. Yeah, okay, that's all she has to say. Um. On the off chance Blythe is still down here, I want to go tell him before Soap. So let's check one more time if he's down here. If not, I'll go back up to the, the three sisters and I think leave things there for the night. Because, yeah, it's it's 2 a.m. Uh, It's 2 o'clock in the morning. I've been streaming for 11 and a half hours. I promise this will be the last thing I do for the night. Yeah, he's still there. I can see him. I can see him off in the distance. I can go the distance. Ow. Quit it. I need to speak with you. So what I want to know is like, after talking to EG, it's clear why him and Blythe are like, dedicated to her where the frig does soap come in oh shit is my question i gotta wait for them to despawn and stop chasing me please go away i wish to talk to my good friend okay ah well met hello what news Tell Selen's story. Hmm. So Rani's fate is kept in stasis by Star's curse Radan. That reminds me of something I heard. There's a festival being held at the castle on the southern edge of the Caled Wilds, east of Limgrave. Okay. It's a festival of combat. And I heard. That's the third person to mention that. Fight Radan himself. He who was once called the strongest of all the demigods. The strongest. Maybe it's just a coincidence. Uh oh. But I think it's worth investigating. Yeah. I'll be on my way to this festival of Radan. Shit. Oh god, part of this quest line is to do that fight. I've been avoiding that area this whole time. <laughs> Guess what we're starting tomorrow, chat. <laughs> You're coming too, right? To Radan's festivities. Uh huh. I'll meet you at Red Main Castle in Caled. <laughs> the way is amazingly simple. We fight, sword and fight. I already cleared it out. You're good. You're coming too, right? All Aren't right. Oh ahead? man. <sighs> Son of a beat. No, I don't wanna. Chad, I don't wanna. <sighs> All right, I'm gonna go tell EG if I can. Go back to soap, and I think we'll stop. I do not want to start up the game in tomorrow. The game tomorrow for stream and just be in the red zone already. I'd like to be in a happy place. I don't want to go to Kaled. <laughs> Greetings, my fellow. I take it you've heard of the Eternal Well. No, I can't update him. Lies, to be honest. Yeah, that's that stuff we discussed already. Okay. 
All right. Mm, I guess back up here. Here's the thing is I, I don't feel super comfy about telling Soap about this. He seems a little iffy. You know what I mean? I don't, I don't know how to feel about him being a part of it. You know what I mean? Oh. I mean, that's provided he even cares if we try to talk to him. So the goal is Radon tomorrow, huh? I know nothing of this Radon except what little I've heard about this festival. But Blythe's gonna be there. That's cool. Um, the other two that I've discussed this with was the pot Alexander and at Redmain Castle it was that old guy at the end I forget his name I think it started with a J but him he seems a little bit mysterious at the moment No time for idle chit. The only thing I are we and I have enough. Perfect. Okay. So I do know that I have not explored everything in the manor. I think I've had enough spider hands for one one day for now. So I think maybe when I can slap them silly with my own hands, when I'm stronger, I'll come back. Oh man. Dude, so much done today. Today was so great. And we're going here. Oh shit, where did Blythe say he was going to be? At the festival. Redmain Castle, right. He was going to be at Redmain Castle. So I guess we'll go to Redmain. Yeah. Fine, I'll leave myself here. straight for way too long tonight chat oh my god whoa and there he is wait who are these guys champions welcome the stars of aligned the festival is that the old man general radon mightiest demigod of the shattering awaits you Champions, prepare. Is this Halo? Defeat the general, claim glory, and grab that great rune. A celebration of war. The Radon Festival. All right, hang tight here for a sec. So Blythe is here. This sounds like Halo. Almost. So Blythe is here. Who are you? Thank you. I don't think I've met her before. She just bowed at me. Blythe is here. I don't know who this guy is. looks like a beetle then this guy I don't know who he is either hey it's Alexander hey buddy ah you came hello so delightful indeed I thought I might find you here by the by that's what you, you said for whom this festival is being held well it is none other than general Radan himself I could face a great champion of the shattering, a demigod in the flesh. Oh, God. In truth, I quiver at the thought. Such is his frightful repute. But the fear simply assures me the ordeal is worth undertaking. Be sure to get a good vantage, my friend. I, Iron Fist Alexander, do 
hereby vow to unflinchingly brave this ordeal. But you're a pot. All he has to do is step on you. Dude, I'm I'm getting Halo vibes listening to this. That's not a bad thing. Oh, in the rain. Dramatic effect. Okay, I didn't realize that a cut like some kind of dialogue was gonna trigger if I came here. Ah. There you are. Took your sweet time. I get the players are all made up. I'm waiting for the curtain. Let's give them a show to remember, eh? Just don't you go dying on me. For Ronnie's sake, too. I'll probably die a few times knowing boss fights. And this guy has his shard, so it's gonna be tough. He'll probably kick my ass a few times, I I I'm sad to say. Ooh, stutters, please. Is there anybody else here to talk to? Oh my god, I could listen to this music all day. Am I? No. I wonder if there's anybody else I could have collected for this. Because two MV NPCs I've interacted with have ended up here. Head to bed now? Yeah, I'm working on it. I'm working on it too. I'm just super enjoying the music. Okay, well this is... Wow. Wait, there's this guy over here. Yeah, I saw him already. And I can go up and talk to this guy? Oh yeah, there's... It says I did it because there was like a previous boss fight in there. Yeah, and then there's this guy. Nice sword. That's the flamberge. Are you good and prepared, young chum? The festival begins. Don't you automatically trigger a cutscene. Okay, good. So I'm guessing if I say I'm ready, that'll take me into the boss fight. I'm already butt clenching. This seems like a big deal. But we're not gonna- we're not gonna do it right now, obviously. Okay. Oh, the music, dude. So good. Okay. There's one more- th one thing I forgot. We'll start with tomorrow. No, tomorrow's Friday? Today's Friday. Maybe I'll do a bonus stream, we'll see. We'll see! We'll see. It's this. I want to do this today, didn't get the chance to, so we'll start with it next time. Um, and I'll, I'll just let you guys know. I'm still awake, we're just about to end here. I lost track of time one too many times. Yeah, we'll, we'll start here tomorrow.